friend in birth declared his chief decision. Now let us have a last talk. <laughs> Instructive conversation on Anapanasati. Anapanasati. <clears throat> I wanted to summarize all Dhamma into mindfulness development. And now we will discuss about the truth of anatta, not self, not self, anatta. Uh, <clears throat> Buddhism have a very important uh, principle as uh, not ta, not self, seeing a uh, not ta. <laughs> the mind released, it was released from anything which it attached to before releasing self out <laughs> like uh, come out of a uh, Christian. <laughs> Christian, self in Christian meant that is the mind attached to the self. And now we, we want to see the truth of not self or anatta, anatta in Pali. <coughs> We have to see in the truth of anatta in the life itself or in the mind and body or in the five or aggregate, kantha, kantha aggregate, aggregate, equivalent to kantha in Pali, kantha means Part, part, five of part, <laughs> or section, five section of life. Seeing anatta in the life as a whole, or in the body and mind as a two, in the five aggregate as a five, seeing anatta in this is it. <coughs> Now I want you to see, to look and see Anatta Nes, good dialogue. Anatta Nes. Not every exercise of Anapanasati. Not every exercise of one. <laughs> You see, you understand the best. At the same time, we can see, can know, can understand that the breath is not self. Long breath or short breath, breathing in or breathing out is not self. <clears throat> uh, and then the flesh body was conditioned by breath body, then flesh body cannot be self <laughs> in itself because it is a product of breath body. <laughs> you can see the at anatta <laughs> use the term anatta <laughs> The being of anatta, 
uh, at the breath, uh, at the person, at the uh, flesh body, which is a product of breath body and flesh body, is not sense. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Even the harming of such body or the such body which is harm is not self. <coughs> and then uh, comes to the second group, uh, the exercise of fire. The rapture only is not self. Uh, and the exercise of six. Uh, the happiness itself cannot be self. <coughs> uh, and rapture and happiness is a conditioner uh, of the mind, of the thought. <laughs> then the mind or the thought cannot be self. <coughs> the thought is the thought that of feeling rapture and happiness. And then the calming down hmm, of the conditioner of the mind or the mind calm and not be self. All these are not self and not star. And come to the third group. The third that's it. <coughs> the six exercise in nine, every aspect of mind as we have the cut. Every aspect, any aspect cannot be self. <laughs> Thought that of the feeling the Vedana. <laughs> Uh, even the enjoy, a joyful mind cannot be self. Stable mind cannot be self. Resisting mind cannot be self. Now we we'll come to the last subject. Uh, the exercise uh, 13. Seeing uh, this of everything, everything cannot be self. Even the fading away of attachment, or the mind which is fading away of attachment, but the mind cannot be called self. And then exercise to keep the extinction of attachment and the mind with the attachment extinct uh, and not uh, be called self. <laughs> And finally, the throwing out of all fillets that on attachment, no self, not self. If you understand them well, all 16 exercises, you can see everything is not self, not self. Then anything out of these 16 can be seen. Because in 16 steps we can see body and mind and try to contact as not self, not self, and not star. <coughs> we understand this. Seeing the truth of this, 
until to look and see that <coughs> the life is self, is not self. Body and mind is not self. Five aggregate is not self. And all these compounded things <laughs> as a body and mind is not self. And then I want you to have a sentence <laughs> to remember you are you which is not you. <laughs> understand? You <laughs> understand this? You are you which is not you <laughs> because it is a real thing of self. No real you. <laughs> Only illusive you <laughs> come from ignorance, <laughs> did not know the truth <laughs> of the life. <laughs> Even say for me, I will say, I am self which is not Self, okay. You try to understand this. <laughs> Not uh, food land. Amusing speaking. Not joke. not food land. <laughs> not a joke. Amusing joke. But <laughs> the real truth. <laughs> you are you. Which is not you. And then you have yourself. Which is not yourself. <laughs> the same thing. You are you, which is not you. You have yourself, which is not yourself. Try to understand this. You will understand the <laughs> truth of not self or anatta. Try you, your best uh, to see every uh, object of 16 exercises of Anapanasati Havana. <coughs> you can use uh, this, uh, this, uh, <laughs> this statement to I, to you, to he, <laughs> uh, to mine, to me, uh, to him, to there, to them, every term is used in uh, somewhat, uh, somewhat the such a Relative truth. Relative, relative truth, conventional truth, not ultimate truth. Relative truth. Relative means relate to ignorance. <laughs> relate to ignorance. <laughs> then this is called it relative truth, <laughs> not a real truth, not ultimate truth. <coughs> No than that. <laughs> we are men, which is not men. <laughs> you are a man, which is not a man. <laughs> he is a man, which is not a man. <laughs> Only a compounded thing. And compute, <laughs> component, element, uh, compound that <laughs> touch at the first aggregate, <laughs> and we call it man. <laughs> In reality, it's not a man, only compounded thing, <laughs> natural compounded thing. <laughs> then we can say a man which is not a man. <laughs> 
when it is not a man, you cannot call it American, European, Australian. <laughs> you cannot call it because you know the real man, the real person. You come here as an American. You go back as a boy, <laughs> as a boy outside, <laughs> not a man. <laughs> if you understand this, you understand the truth of anatta, anatta. <laughs> not the amusing joke, <laughs> but the real thing, ultimate truth. But uh, look, uh, sounded like an amusing joke. <laughs> I ask you to try to understand this. <clears throat> the important principle of the Dhamma of Buddhism is uh, anatta, anatta. Seeing anatta can get rid of on on kind of uh, attachment, attachment of any kind, any respect. You have to do away with it, that attachment, in the concept of I, of self. Now the usefulness uh, of uh, anapanasati pavana of a sixteen step. Look at the step by the step by the step, seeing the truth of anatta inside us. <coughs> this is the first <laughs> point. Uh, to have a usefulness, we call it anisangsa, the flowing out of the milk, <laughs> the body term, anisangsa, flowing out of the milk from a cow, <laughs> uh, from a knowledge uh, of anatta. <laughs> You can get it all out of all attachment of the laser. <coughs> now you come to know the second point of the usefulness of the Anapanasati. You have to drink of uh, Five essence of the whole Dhamma, essence of whole Dhamma. To find the term Sara means uh, essence, essence, as if you remember the pen, the Part of the wood which is hard, and hard wood, <laughs> hard wood can, hard wood, come come dear one can, pit, pit, the pit, hard wood of the wood, in Pali, Sara, Sara. Hmm. I prefer to use the term essence, even the Peter hard wood is the essence of the, the wood. Hmm. Now, try for essence of uh, the whole Dhamma, we call it five essence of the whole Dhamma. Divide it into five. 
you see five foot pole at the top of the roof everywhere. Now five foot pole at that. that. Five as sense of the whole Dhamma. The first is Sila, Sila, morality. The second is Samadhi, concentration. The third, Panya, intuitive wisdom. The fourth, Vimutti, emancipation or liberation. The fifth, knowing that emancipated or liberated. Five, Sila, Samadhi, Panya, Vimutti, Vimutti, Yana, Dhasana. Morality, concentration, wisdom, emancipation, and knowing that emancipated. You remember five things. Five things. Five things. In the whole set of Ahnapanasati, of 16 steps, you can find these five <coughs> extents. As for sila of morality, it is the controlling of on the mind <laughs> to practice to command the mind to practice. To command the mind to be mindful, to be in mindfulness, this, this is called Sīla. <laughs> now Sīla in wider sense, commanding the mind to do the function, to do the duty of the mind. Every step, every exercise of 16 steps has such a sila. And then in Anapati we have sila as a whole. And samadhi or concentration in exercise of four, we have a body conditioner calm until the mind calm. That is samadhi or concentration. And at exercise eight, having the mind itself calm to be calm. That is. Samadhi, mm-hmm. exercise of four and exercise of eight is of Samadhi, having Samadhi as a result. Now, come to Panya, Panya. <laughs> you have to have a Panya, some scale at every exercise of Sixteen exercise. Mm. Especially in the thirteen exercise, seeing and it's young, and that is the utmost seeing of panya, utmost of panya uh, at thirteen success. See in Anichang, see in Anichang, where the form of Anichang, as we have this touch. Now, we mutti, we mutti emancipation. The exercise of 14 and 15. <laughs> uh, see in. Spreading away attachment, 
seeing extinction of attachment that is emancipation uh, from the very from the very beginning and to the uh, final <coughs> emancipation takes place bit by bit at the exercise for the <laughs> utmost scale at the exercise fifteen. Then come to Vimuttiyana Tatsuna, knowing that now emancipated, that is the last exercise, exercise 16. <coughs> and another, <laughs> another time to call it Pacha Vekana Yan, looking it particularly. That now manifested. <coughs> now you can see all essence of fight <laughs> included in the system of Anapanasati of sixteen steps. <coughs> then you can say <laughs> it is all as a whole of Buddhism. All of Tamma, a Buddhism, or a whole Buddhism. See in this essence of the whole Tamma. <coughs> Having five thinkers for remembrance, <coughs> then know that Sila, Samati, Panya, Vimutti, Vimutti, Yana, Tatsana. Morality, concentration, wisdom, emancipation, knowing that now emancipated. <coughs> the result of Anapanasati. Now you <coughs> all of you are acquainted with the earthfold path. Earthfold path. Can I have to go and do that? No. Right view, right aim, right speech, right conduct, right liplifood, right effort, right <coughs> mindfulness, and right concentration. And the term right, I prefer to use the term correct, correct. At correctness, at full part, you can see, look and see and try all of this head in the whole system of 16 steps of Anapanasati. When we know the truth of this, it is, it is a right view. <laughs> then we want to incorrect way to use it, to practice it, <laughs> to be manifested. <laughs> that is right aim. <laughs> As far right to speed, right to conduct, right livelihood. Easy to see all the time. We have a result of right to speech, right to conduct, and right to livelihood. Even we did not speak, but we have a right to correct the speech and the speech conduct and livelihood. Now we are sitting still. What pool of right speak, right conduct, and right livelihood. And then we try our best to practice all the way. That is the right effort, 
he has to be my fool all the way or practice anapasati that is the right uh, my fool made we concentrate uh, upon the practice object of uh, for the practice uh, is a right of concentration you try to look and you will see all it fakta <coughs> anka anka it anka it fakta uh, of the path which is called eight fold path eight fold pali eight anka fakta you can see in five eight fakta in the whole system of anapanasati bhavana <laughs> Right, your best, you will find. The most important thing to say about the people of the world. And that's a group or a set. Our Dhamma called Phot Sankha, the factor of enlightenment, factor of enlightenment, it is a servant, servant Phot Sankha. All seven Pochanka can be found in the whole system of Anapanasati, of 16th step. You will see yourself when I, 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 when I say and I should be to eat. The first Pochanka is Sati, Sati. My fullness, you have to see all the time of practice Anapanasati. We had the first, first factor, first angha, the first factor as sati, mindfulness. The second angha factor, tamma vijaya, analyze, analyzing the tamma. And to know it, <laughs> we analyze uh, the best of all aspects uh, of the factory of it, uh, and of our feelings and rapture and happiness and every aspect of the mind, many, many aspects, many aspects. Uh, at the nine exercise, Hamma Vitya analyze analyzing of Hamma now at the third Anka or the third factor is Vitya. That is the effort, effort, effort. Have to be used at every exercise of the whole set of anapanasati. The fourth anka or factor is piti. And means piti means contentment. Contentment. If the contentment uh, is the best, we call it pity. If it calm down, we call it the happiness, sukha. Now, sukha or happiness included in the term pity of the fourth factor. <coughs> 
Mm-hmm. In the exercises six, <laughs> we treat upon the PT, the PT, as a conditioner of the mind, and have it <laughs> as a subject of concentration, and use it as a energy or a power uh, to erect uh, happiness. In the sixth factor is the calming down, the calming down, the calming down of the mind. We have this factor in the exercise four and exercise eight. Having the body conditioner calm, having the mind conditioner calm at the exercises four and the exercise eight. And then the sixth factor is smarty itself. In the whole set of Navasati, we have concentration, adequate scale at every step from the very beginning to the last. And especially in the exercise of four and the exercise of eight, we have a full scale of concentration or smarty. The last factor called the Upekha, Upekha. In this uh, practice, I will call this uh, equilibrium, equilibrium, but uh, Tam Samadha Mandriya. Uh, equanimity. equanimity, equanimity, equanimity. It has a special meaning. <laughs> Upekha means look at. Look, looking at, uh, at the back, like a hunting. Hunting, looking, hunting, looking. Look at the Tamma. We practice in correct way. Uh, such as a, a, a simile of it in the Pali term. Like a, a man, charioteer, holding the rope, uh, tied to the horse, drawing the chariot. When the road good, everything good, <laughs> the charioteer only to hold, only to hold the rope. Good evening, rope. So if you mark it, we'll mark Rain. Huh? Rain. Rain. <laughs> no, no. Um, I rain. And then the rope <laughs> from the heart. Heart. Only to hold the rope. <laughs> ah, when the... When all things correct, you have only to hold the, the wheel. <laughs> The wheel of the car, no need to do anything. The meaning of the term of the car, let it go. When all things is correct, is ready, of the car. After we have practiced the, the Thamma, all exercises, uh, 
อ correct 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 เราคนที่ถึงลุกแอดดิสตัวอ่อนตัวอ่อนอ่อนอ่อนมาอิสระมีเดลาร์เดลาร์เพอร์เฟกเตอร์ของเซเว่นเฟกเตอร์ของเอนไลท์เมนต์ on the seven factor of enlightenment that can be found in the whole set of a n a p h a n a s a t i of s i x t e e n steps. You can try your best to look and see these seven factor of enlightenment. <coughs> Now, <coughs> you come to look. <laughs> At the usefulness of anapana s a t i every man of every every job of every uh, every life, uh, life uh, one, ah, 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 Life l i v e h o 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 Can make use of anapanasati in the time of a job of his function, his duty. Businessmen, e c o n o m i s t can make use of the benefit of. อานาปานาสติสัมติสอาติสลาเยอร์เป็นมิจยูสออฟอานาปานาสตินักบวชในความหมายทั่วไปว่านักบวชบุญเลี้ยงที่ก็นักบวชแคลร์แคลร์แคลร์แคลร์แคลร์แคลร์แคลร์แคลร์แคลร์แคลร์แคลร์แคลร์แคลร์แคลร์แคลร์แคลร์แคลร์แคลร์แคลร์แคลร์แคลร์แคลร์แคลร์แคลร์แคลร์แคลร์แคลร์แคลร์แคลร์แคลร์ Monk of every religion, he called it n a t b o t Student of every school, hmm. and the man who p r o p a g a n d a t h a m m a and c o n t r a p a g a n d i s t p r o p a g a n d i s t have to use, <laughs> make use. <laughs> the benefit of anapanasati. t i l t e n and n a k p a t i b a t n a k s i k s a and n a k p a t i b a t Uh, practitioner, student, or practitioner have to make use uh, of my fullness in the function because uh, they can have uh, my fullness, wisdom, attentiveness, and concentration. They are well versed in these four things. 
can help them to be used in the moment of function of he, of them. Finally, anyone who wants to have sudden happiness, they call it sudden happiness, happiness at that moment he wants to have by means of anapanasati. He can have and have uh, happiness, sudden happiness at that moment that he wants it. <coughs> And then they can have happiness, the passion, right? <laughs> happiness of the passion aspect that did not bite the own. <laughs> happiness that did not bite the own. That is a happiness from anapanasati. The practice of it can be both as art and science. And the beauty in the practice, beauty in a spiritual way. <laughs> And we call art as a Buddhist art. And the art of uh, liberating himself uh, from suffering. <laughs> high art <laughs> of Buddhist. <laughs> we use the same term, high art. High art, and another way, high art, high art, material. Okay, now in the spiritual way, high art, that is the art of liberating, liber uh, at, uh, as a liberating himself from suffering. <laughs> and being a science, being a science, as, uh, it has to use the method of science. Having the real object, treat upon the object, no need to have a hypothesis, no, no. Only real thing, treat upon the real thing, experiment on it, check it, prove it <laughs> in the way of science, that's a lot of science. The practice of Dhamma can be regarded as uh, both uh, art and science. <coughs> I have to use the term <laughs> very strange to you. Scientific art. <laughs> Artistic science. <laughs> You have ever heard this good term? <laughs> scientific art. Art is science. Mm. An artistic science. Science is artistic. Of, <laughs> of artistic. <laughs> you will look and see the, this fact <laughs> from the whole set of Anapanasati as an art as an art, uh, as a science, then have it <laughs> as an artistic science, scientific art. <laughs> to try to know the meaning. <clears throat> it can be called that It uh, comprises uh, all ways of all religions to get rid of uh, 
defilement. <laughs> and all science <clears throat> and all culture, culture, the knowing of anatta is topmost, topmost culture of humanity, of human world. And before this, no culture uh, such a high culture uh, as to be beyond all problems. And to know the truth of not self. And then can be beyond the influence of positive wisdom and negative wisdom. The kind of God is as a top mode the culture <laughs> by the Lord Buddha. In India, we, uh, in India before the time of Buddha, no such a instruction to be beyond all positive and negative or to get rid of all meaning of self. Now we have the term anatta, anatta. Uh, very important to know the meaning of it. <coughs> you, will, you will remember the three terms. Atta, anatta, and the niratta. Atta means the self at the full scale. Self at full scale. Niratta means none, no sin, not sin, any type, any being, any effect. In the middle, we have anatta. Self, which is not self, understand <laughs> it, as I told you, you are you, which is not you, which is not you. Self, which is not self. In reality, it is an elusive self. What ignorant man <laughs> grasping at a set as, as a real self. Then we call the self which is not self <laughs> because it is not real self. Art and science <laughs> to get uh, at the fact and the truth <laughs> of knowing. The self, elusive self, which is the real self. My means of practice are not panacea, a whole set of 16 steps. You can have such an art in a science <laughs> to come out uh, of. Uh, Illusiveness of ignorance deceive us all the time. Now we are we can not be deceived by ignorance again. <laughs> Try to remember. Self, which is not self, but everyone has it as a real self. Problem, take place. The self is a burden, tormenting everyone who attaches to it, touching at it, cling to it, now come out 
or do away with the self, the ignorance, ignorance, uh, deceive us, deceiving us to have a self. Now we are free from self. <laughs> Rather suddenly, we are free from ourselves. <laughs> free from ourselves. You are free from yourself. Because you are you, it's not you. <laughs> you remember this. Uh, free. <laughs> ourselves, from ourselves, <coughs> because it is loosely free. And this we call anisang, anisang sa, flowing out of the milk, <coughs> the flowing milk <coughs> from the tamma. Then have it knowledge of not self, the teaching of not self, <laughs> the truth of not self, Buddhism, the religion of not self. <laughs> <laughs> you have to know the self which is not self, <laughs> you which is not you, man which is not man, only this. Benefit. <laughs> From Anapanasati, whole set of Anapanasati, of 16 sets. Now it's finished. <laughs> Our conversation. Thank you very much. Good listener, endearing to listen, my speaking. Come to English at a Chinese speaking time. <laughs> Thank you.